welcome to today. Let's begin this full body practice seated. And once you're in a comfy seat, long spine, we'll begin moving the body, the shoulders in a sort of spontaneous way. Just move with the feeling. If you're sore, if there's any tension, just begin paying attention to those areas and stretching it out, releasing it. Let's roll the shoulders up as we inhale and roll them back and down. Inhale them up and back. Intentional rolls here one more time. And let's do it to the front. We want deep breaths here, so inhale them up. Roll it to the front. Exhale. If you'd like to close your eyes, tune in. You can do that. So inhale them up. Good. And release them down. Let's clasp the hands behind us. I love this. Just opening the chest here. Opening the heart. Tilting the head up. Pulling your hands back behind you and release, come to your mat. We'll come to our, seated on our heels. And I'd like for us to go ahead and do child's pose, reaching the palms forward, getting a deep shoulder stretch. And even if we do have a shorter session today, we really want to be mindful and slow down the mind. So pay attention to the breath and releasing to the earth. Especially when we're short on time, we want to prioritize this stillness and peace of mind here. So take a deep breath in, all the way filling up. And side out. Good, and slowly bring the hands by your back, clasping them behind you. Begin to lift at the hips, lifting at the arms, letting them fall towards your head. Getting a deeper shoulder stretch there. Uh, balancing at the top of your head here. If there's too much pressure on your head, just come back to child's pose. And you can still do the arm release here without getting on the top of your head. And release that. Help yourself to your tabletop, inhaling to your uh, cow, and exhaling to a deep rounded cat. Move with your breath. Tune into your body. Waking up the body. Creating a flow of energy. Openness. Last exhale, really big and round. Inhale to neutral, roll the toes, downward facing dog. Bent knees can alternate. Uh, weight is in all of our fingertips here, not just our wrists. Pushing the chest towards the thighs. And inhale, slowly begin walking towards your hands. Release in your forward fold. Standing fold. Release in the back. The knees are bent. And shake it out. And on your inhale, slowly begin lifting up. Nice and slow and conscious. Arms out and up, reaching. Get tall. And palms to heart. 
And once again, we'll reach palms out and up. Spread the legs two hip width apart. Inhale deep, exhale to a chair, pushing the hips back. Knees are above your ankles. Bring the palms to your heart. See if we can have a long spine, not slouched, not forward, but tall. <sighs> Inhaling deep, feeling the strength in the legs. And on this inhale, Deep, we're going to exhale to a twist onto a, the right side. So your left forearm on the right leg. And if you can deepen the twist, bringing the chest even higher. Breathing here, focus. On your exhale, come to center. Forward fold, shake the legs out, palms to the earth. Fully let go, let it all out, let it go. If you don't need it, let it just come out of you and release it. And inhaling to your chair, right into chair here, palms to heart. Breathe here. Deep breaths, relaxing the face. Inhale. On this exhale, we'll twist to the left. Breathing. And on your exhale, forward fold, release, release the back. You can roll and sway. <sighs> Once again, we'll clasp the hands behind our back and allow them to fall towards the head if that feels good for you. Release the arms. Come to halfway lift as you inhale. Elongate the back. Exhale down, walk the hands out to plank. High strong plank here. Inhale and exhale, chaturanga. Elbows bent and a gentle Upward facing dog. And downward facing dog, roll the toes. Good. And inhale the right leg up to the sky, dog split. Bend the knee, twist the hips open, stacking the hips. Weight is in both your palms. Deep stretch in the side, breathing. And to dog split, really extend. And step forward into your lunge. And inhale your palms up. Reach to the sky. And palms down. Drop the back knee. Inhale up. Palms up. And meet in downward dog. Inhale the left leg to dog split, extending it up. And bend that knee, stacking the hips, opening. Weight is distributed right and left. Breathing, opening. Inhale to a dog split really deep. And exhale the foot between the palms. And inhale the arms up. <sighs> Good. Exhale the palms down. Release the back knee down. And lift up once again. And come into a child's pose. So Come to the earth. And inhale up. We'll shift to seated. Rolling back to sit bones, bringing the legs in front of you. 
So lengthen the spine tall. Guess what's next? We're going to lean back a little, preparing to lift the legs, bending at the knees into our first boat. Strong core, breathing, focusing. Finding the strength in our power center. Strengthening willpower. Breathing and releasing. One more breath. And release the legs down. And roll the back in whichever way feels good. We're going to do a boat one more time. You can extend the legs or keep them bent. Inhale. And extend. Choose your boat. Palms can face up. Gathering strength. Keeping the back tall. Shoulders are down, away from the ears. Breathe here. Breathe in your power. Willpower. I can do this. I can do this. Tell yourself, you can do this. You got this. Hold it. Breathe. Shaking in that core. It's okay. Persevere. One more breath here. You got it. And release it down. Very nice. Good. Let's bend the right leg in to the left thigh. Face the hips toward that left leg. Inhale the arms up. Really pull them up. Maybe clasping the top, pulling yourself up long. And then exhaling, slowly folding towards the left side. If you can reach your feet here, you know what I like to do. <laughs> Otherwise, reach for your legs wherever you can here. Meeting yourself where you're at today. Inhaling up. Oh, give that ankle some loving, some rolling. Bring the leg in. We'll do a little butterfly here before we do the other side. So opening the hips. Seeing how open the hips are today. Maybe it's a little more stiff or maybe you're more flexible. So just observe. And move in the way that might feel good for your inner thighs and hips. And help them up. Extend the right leg out. Left leg in. Face the leg. So tilting the hips toward the leg. Inhale, reach. Real tall and exhaling toward this wonderful leg of ours. Leg of yours and mine. However we can give love to this side, do so. And slowly turn me up. Give this ankle a quick roll. Extend both legs out in front of you. Arms reaching up and inhaling. Exhale, bending at the hips, keeping the back long. It's not slouching here. Long back. And deepening on your exhale if you have any more left, any further to go here. Once you've exhaled all your breath out, inhale your way up. So we'll do a little sort of balance here as we get a deeper stretch through our legs. So bending at the right, grab the outside of your left right and just bend it here, extending it, extend it towards the sky 
or even pulling it towards your face if you can. Make sure your face is relaxed and not scrunched. And you can also pull it with both hands here. You'd like to deepen the stretch. Flexing the foot, Oof. breathing into the tightness. And slowly bring that leg down. Grab the outside of the left, bending at the knees, and extend it up. Breathing here. And if you'd like, deepen it, bring both hands, bring it towards your face. And slowly drop that leg. Going to roll onto our back and allow yourself this moment to get out any other kinks or do any other stretches you might need to feel complete. Before we lay here for the next few minutes in complete stillness, even if it's just inner stillness. So extend the legs, flatten the back down, release the body completely to the earth, releasing your muscles, letting them relax, relaxing the face. Give yourself this time to shut off that mind that keeps on turning Letting it rest. Just breathing normally. And letting yourself be filled head to toe with new, loving oxygen new energy, renewing yourself. Stay as long as feels right and you have time for. And when you're ready to come out, you can move your fingertips and toes and just begin slowly coming back, knowing you deserve this time for yourself and deserve time to slow down. <sighs> I'm going to finish in seated, bringing the palms to my heart. I honor the divinity in me. You are a beautiful reflection and I honor the divinity in you. This love in us is sacred and I embrace it. I hope that you do the same. From my heart to yours, namaste.